and welcome back to Quick Tips. In this week's video, I wanna to talk to you a little bit about collaging with AI. Now, we all know that in Express, we can scroll down here and we can generate text to image, but I find that sometimes I don't get exactly what I'm looking for with this. But if I start to use AI on top of AI, I can really improve my content. So to get started, I'm gonna to go to the big purple plus button. I'm gonna do a Instagram square post and I'm going to go to text to image. For this, I'll generate a square and I'm gonna say college student holding books and hit generate. I'm going to use this photo right here and then blow it up to fit in my space. Now, I like this photo, but I really don't like the background. I find it kind of boring. So what I'm gonna do, click into the gray, click on the photo, and then select remove background. This way I have my character removed from the background. Now what I'm gonna do is go back over here to media, text to image, square, and this time I'm going to generate a college library and hit generate. And here you can see that we've gotten a college library with a student in it, so let's try something else. Let's try empty college library. There we go, now we have an image that we can use as a backdrop for our piece. I think I'll choose this one. Again, I'm going to scale this up, and this time what I'm gonna do is click and drag this behind my character. Now with that, what I could very easily do is grab my character here, maybe resize the character, move him down a little bit so I have plenty of space if I wanted to put text or graphics over here. I can continue to modify this, and this is what I like about separating this out and starting to collage with it. Additionally, if I wanted to do something more with this, I could start to animate it. So with my character selected, if I scroll down, I can choose animation, and I can make my character pop in, fade in, rise up, something like that, and start to create a look of a more animated piece that I couldn't have done with a single AI image. And now we can see that my character's drifting in and I have a much more interesting piece just by collaging with a little bit of AI right here in Adobe Express. Well, that's it for this week. Hope to see you again next week for another quick 